Hi everyone, I'm Alexis. I'm a Goldfarb alumni from 2016. The most challenging thing for me at Goldfarb was managing my home life and my school life. I was going through a divorce. I had just moved from a different state. I was living with my parents. I had a two-year-old son at home. Um, it was really challenging trying to juggle homework and take care of things at home. The advice I would give my younger self is um, think about my career sooner in high school. I could have shadowed, I could have asked more questions. Um, instead, I waited till the end of my junior year, early senior year to really decide on what I wanted to do. The advice that I would give my mentees is push through this. I know that it's hard um, and it seems never ending, but it'll be so worth it. It's a small chunk of your life. You'll be really glad that you did. Hi there, my name is Allison Fung. I am 20 years old and I am a third year at San Francisco State University. I have been mentoring with Peer to Peer for a year now and I just reapplied to be a mentor for another year and I love it. Um, I love supporting students through this difficult transition from high school or wherever it is that students are coming from um, as they're beginning their time in university. Um, Unfortunately, when I came into school as a first generation student, I did not have this type of support, this unique type of support. So I love that I can still be a part of this change now and help students uh, get the help that they need that I didn't have. And I want to use my experience and expertise to help them in any way that I can, especially as an aspiring social worker. I love this experience. I find it very valuable and um, not many places have what peer-to-peer -peer has. So I hope to inspire um, more um, mentees to become mentors to repeat this process because I love this system and I love what they stand for and I hope it's around for a long time. I'm Allison, I'm a mentor with peer-to-peer -peer and I love it. So I decided to become a mentor because I wanted to help new students to figure out what they wanna do and who they wanna be and how to really achieve those goals. I mean, I think it's really important to build relationships, build new relationships when going into any new environment, and to have the ability to be that first person they meet is a it's a really awesome responsibility. And on a more personal note, I think I can learn a lot from my mentees, and I can help them to maybe become a mentor themselves one day. And it's it's. I kind of have this opportunity to create this domino effect that I think could have a real big impact. And, and that's something that's really cool. Hi, my name is Julie Bedhauser. I graduated from Concordia University in December of 2019 with a master's in education, emphasis on early childhood education. I completed the program online with a small cohort of women from all over the country. Yeah, the idea of going back to school after 25 years was a bit daunting, so I must admit I used every support out there that they offered. If they would have passed out awards along with our degrees, mine probably would have been most improved. From learning how to do research to reminding myself about APA formatting, managing Blackboard, and staying on track juggling full-time work and a family, I needed a strong support system. But that's exactly why I signed up to be a mentor for you, if possible. So I could be part of your circle of support because that's so important. And I'm here to let you know that you're not alone. Whatever question you have, I probably have asked it or found the answer to it before. And I know Concordia and I can hook you up with the resources that you need in case that I don't have the answer for you. I just wanna keep you going, because it's so important. This degree was something that I'm most proud of in my life. And if I can help one person get there, then that's just icing on the cake. Hi, my name is Mystery. I am a mentor for Goldfarb School of Nursing and a graduate from their 2012 accelerated BSN program. Since then, I have been in cardiothoracic surgery. I've been an educator for general surgery, orthopedics, and acute rehab. And now I am a nursing leader for pain management. 
It wasn't easy to get here though. It was a bit of a ride. Um, so my challenge was primarily in this expectation of perfection. So my advice to you as a nursing student and my advice to my younger self would be to uh, give yourself a little grace. If you already knew everything, you wouldn't need to be there. And you're going into a field that's committed to lifelong learning. You're going to learn every day. So find your people, find your tribe, lift each other up, cheer each other on, because it's not going to be easy, but in the end, it's worth it. So enjoy the ride.